they're finally exposing some things we've been uh, observing for years in the pre-hospital sphere. Um, I'm uh, I'm a bit disappointed in the population as a whole. Women in situations of medical distress in public are reportedly 28% less likely to receive CPR from a bystander than men, according to a recent study by Montreal researchers. Uh, it comes from very wrong narrative that's been uh, enforced in the last 20 years. We've had a lot of people who were uh, afraid of, of approaching a victim and providing care. The, the whole idea that you could go, you could be sued is, is just uh, ludicrous. Uh, we actually have an obligation to provide help in Quebec. The study looked at 39,000 cardiac arrests in Canada and the U.S. from 2005 to 2015 that happened outside a hospital setting. Overall, researchers found 23% of cardiac arrests happened in public locations, with most cases 71% involving men. We see often with uh, witnesses when we arrive as, as first responders or paramedics, uh, not, uh, you know, nobody's performing CPR. And often the comment we get is, well, we were afraid of hurting them. Uh, we weren't sure. So to that, I have a very easy answer. It's if they're already in cardiac arrest, the only negative thing that can happen is that they remain dead. We'll just start as quick as you can to do the chest compressions. The basics of CPR are relatively simple, chest compressions being the main technique. Uh, make sure while well, the, the person is unconscious, uh, the, the, the person is not responding, you call 911, ask for an AED, and then you start to, to, to do the compression. While CPR is very important, using an automated external defibrillator or AED can increase the chances of survival. It's going to uh, analyze the rhythm in the heart uh, and if it's indicated a shock will be recommended. The person needs to press on the button to give the shock and the shock is, uh, we, we hope it's going to restore the normal heartbeat afterward. The fact that you're not trained should not restrict you or restrain you from offering help. Again, the consequences, a certain death versus any positive outcome is better. Locate the nearest defibrillators get some uh, awareness about them and the combination of early CPR and, and early activation of an AED combined with 911 is how we end up saving more lives in Quebec. In Montreal, Gareth Maddock-Jones, City News.